Hello everyone, Kira Dragon Tamer here, and welcome back to my Let's Play on Yoshi's Island. Now, before I begin, I deeply apologize, as the last two videos, I did not even realize that the entire time, my, um, mono mix, stereo mix, or wh whatever it is, was not even on. So, yeah, everything was being recorded from my mic, which is why you barely heard any sound or music from the game. I don't know, I guess I just kind of noticed something was wrong. Anyway, here we are dealing with a blue Yoshi. And before we head inside... Whoa. No! Damn it! Well, my own fault, actually. So I will go ahead and just say that if... If I had actually just jumped up there... I would have, uh, been able to, damn it, I would have been able to, damn it, um, basically get a one-up from a secret, of uh, question mark cloud. Anyway, what I'm doing here now, I should have explained this last video because you saw me do it once or twice, is called the ground pound. It basically lets Yoshi... Well, yeah, do that with soft balls like that, and you can just go to town on it, basically. For, um, poles, like the ones I pounded earlier, it's fine. Now, here is what I'm talking about, alright? There are two modes for throwing eggs. I'm gonna go ahead and switch it. This one is the hasty mode. You can still lock it with R1 and whatnot. However, as soon as you release, it throws. The other one was the patient one. And that's the one I much more prefer. And the patient just does this. You have to push A twice in order to throw a single egg. So let's come down here, grab this, eat both of these guys, and you see that thing right there? Yeah, we'll be going there in a bit. So for now, let's do this. Grab this. Believe me. When you have fails like I did in the last video, you be glad when you have those damn, uh, fail, Arrgh. fail, Arrgh. you, you'll be glad when you have those, uh, middle rings around. There's like four red coins there, plus, ooh, we get our five stars back. Plus two red coins there, and that. Now let's, uh, make it a... Wow. Well, I grabbed one of them without it being too bad. So let's see. Let's go ahead. Up. Oh, it's right here. Alright, so there's that. Now I'm actually going to... Kind of push this down here for a reason. Now you probably hear something in the background. Is the shy guys? They are coming out or whatever they are. And anyway, let's pound these beforehand. It could also be those guys coming up, of which we can just steal them to make eggs. God damn, that sounds so freaking wrong. I guess every Yoshi is female in that sense. Anyway, here we are. The first of the mini games in the game. Balloon throwing. Or throwing balloons. The trick is to type in the combination of uh, of keys as fast as possible. And get the balloon to pop on the bandit across from you. Otherwise, you'll lose. 
Not good, he starts. Yes! <sighs> and we get a one-up. Okay, now normally it's not good to fail pressing the buttons like I did a couple times. However, let's just say, sometimes if you can gauge the timing and everything right, you can take that calculated risk. And when I say calculated, I mean calculated. Because it's normally not good to do that. That could entail you to lose. Now, there's nothing wrong with grabbing these guys before they, uh, kind of come down and become what they, uh, become. Actually, it's kind of a good thing because it saves you, uh, from having to, yeah, deal with them later. Ow! Oh, how did that fucking happen? Shit. Ah, <sighs> god damn it. Anyway, if we bring this down, we have a secret. We have a chance to get a hundred coins or more right here. You just need to be very careful as to when you actually jump off the platform. As there are two sides, you can go up as well. Like so. And there's our hundred coins, so let us go ahead and go back up. Now, this is where the chomp rock comes in handy in this one. If you put it up there and jump off, you can actually get up here. Now, mind you, we are not going to have 100% as we are missing, like, four, um, four stars. So, yeah, that's okay. Had we gotten 100%, we would have unlocked an extra stage. And we get another one up from all that, too. So, thus, we are done with World 1-3. Ooh! Bonus challenge! Yes! <laughs> yeah, I like them a little too much. 96% not too bad, though. Well, 96 points, anyway. You can always go into any of these again to get 100. Now, here we have the scratch -a match The goal? Find three Marios, at the most. If you get any of the Toadies, you get zero. Well, if you get three Toadies, you get zero. That's a Toady. You get one Mario, you get a one-up. You get two Marios, you get a two-up. You get three, and you get a five-up. Okay, so we come out of this with 18 lives. Not too bad. Well, anyway, that's that. So, this is Kira Dragon Tamer signing out, and have a wonderful day.